Understanding the end of an era. Hello, everyone. Today, we're going to explore a fascinating English phrase, the end of an era. This expression is rich in meaning and often used in various contexts. Whether you're a beginner or an advanced English learner, understanding such phrases can greatly enhance your language skills. So, let's dive into what this phrase means and how you can use it effectively. The end of an era is a phrase used to signify the completion or termination of a significant period in time, often marked by notable events or characteristics. This era could be in politics, culture, sports, or even in someone's personal life. The phrase evokes a sense of nostalgia or reflection on the passing of a notable period that had a distinct impact. In this section, we'll explore how the end of an era has been used in historical and cultural contexts. This could involve discussing the end of a monarchy, the fall of a significant political regime, or the closure of an iconic institution. It's a phrase that often carries emotional weight and a recognition of change. To understand better, let's see some examples. 1. When the last episode of a popular TV series aired, many fans said it was the end of an era. 2. The retirement of the longtime company CEO marked the end of an era for the business. These examples show how the phrase can be used to describe both large-scale events and personal experiences. Understanding synonyms can expand your vocabulary. Phrases like, the close of a chapter, turning a new leaf, or a period of transition, carry similar meanings. However, each has its unique nuance, so we'll explore these differences. The end of an era is a powerful expression that captures the feeling of transition and the passing of significant periods. It's a phrase that adds depth to our understanding of change and history. I hope this video helps you grasp its meaning and use it in your conversations and writings. Thanks for watching, and keep learning!